Hi guys, it's Iris. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing, I feel like my lipstick is a little bit off there. Anyway, today we're going to be doing the this or that tag. I was tagged to do this by my friend here on YouTube, Pals Lives Life. I will link her video of her doing this tag down below. Um, I'm going to try not to ramble at the beginning of this video, but you know it always happens. Anyway, I had to write down the questions because... If you have been here before, you know I film all of my videos on my smartphone. I have a tablet, but the Wi-Fi typically does not uh, connect to it. It's it's weird. It's it's flotchy. So I wrote them down. Let's go ahead and just jump into it so I don't ramble anymore. So this is the this or that tag. I think this was originated by Nikki Tutorials. At least that is where we got the questions. So they're in categories. The first category is makeup. So blush or bronzer? Blush, totally blush. I can um, I can do without bronzer most days. I don't even, like today I didn't even put it on. I've just got blush on today. Lip gloss or lipstick? Lipstick. I cannot stand a glossy feel on my lips. Not that it's uncomfortable on my lips, but it makes the rest of my, it gives me the sensation that the rest of my face is oily. So lipstick. Eyeliner or mascara? If I had to pick, if I were on a desert island and I had to pick, do I have eyeliner or mascara? I'm going to go with mascara. Uh, foundation or concealer? Again, desert island, I'm going with foundation. Neutral or color eyeshadow? Totally color eyeshadow. I'm trying to get out of my comfort zone of color and go into neutral. Like, how weird is that? Like, most people... Their comfort zone is neutral and they're trying to branch out into color. I'm trying to branch out of color into neutral. <laughs> like, I'm reverting. I'm going back. Anyway, color eyeshadow. Uh, pressed or loose shadow? Pressed. I don't think I've ever even used a loose eyeshadow. Um, I am very intrigued by the loose pigments, but I am scared to death of them. So, haven't, haven't branched out into that yet. Brushes or sponges? I don't think I can pick. Um, excuse me. I don't think I can pick between a brush or a sponge because I use both on a daily basis. I use a sponge to do my foundation and my concealer, any of like my cream makeups. And I use brushes for everything else. So I don't think I can really pick one or the other on that one. Uh, the next section is nails. So OPI or China Glaze. I'm going to go with OPI just because I've never used anything from China Glaze. Uh, long or short nails? I am going to say long nails. My nails are typically short because I am a biter. Um, I've actually, I don't know if you can see that I actually have length. Like you can see, you can see nails past my fingers. Um, that takes a lot of willpower, and a lot of dedication, and just, whew, I really gotta, I really gotta hunker down in order to grow my nails out. And I love for my nails to be long. But like I said, I'm a biter, I'm a picker, so it takes a while. But I'm going to say long nails because that's how I like my nails to be. Acrylic or natural? Totally natural. Acrylic tears up my nails so bad, so I'm going to say natural. Brights or darks? Brights. Dark, dark polish just doesn't look good on me. Um, I don't know why that is. I guess maybe because of how pale I am. Maybe that's why dark colors don't look good. But anyway, we're going to say bright. Uh, flower or no flower? I'm assuming they mean decals. Um, no. Mm -mm. Every now and then I like to do nail art on my nails, but I don't typically use decals. Um, next section is body. Perfume or body splash? Body splash. I'm gonna... It's kind of messy over here, but... These right here, these I don't even use. This one... Is the only one that I actually ever use. That's the only perfume that I ever use. Everything else down here is all body splash, like even in here. That's my cucumber melon, by the way. Um, if you follow me on Instagram, you will know that I recently went to Bath and Body Works and um, had to way hold myself back from spending way too much money because they've released some uh, discontinued scents, specifically discontinued scents from like the 90s, from like the era that I was in high school. When we were all like obsessed with cucumber melon and I totally bought cucumber melon. I almost bought pear berry but I talked myself out of it. 
but yeah, you should follow me on Instagram so you can see that because I'm posting like a lot of that type of stuff right now. Um, okay, lotion or body butter? I prefer body butter. I don't really use either one very often. I have been trying to use this Copper Tone Gradual Tan Sunless Tanning Lotion. Um, and it's a moisturizing lotion. I've been trying to use that just because there are some parts of my body that take color really, really well, and there are other parts of my body that don't take color at all. My legs will not take color from the sun. Neither will my stomach. So I've been trying to use that, but not counting that, I prefer to use a body butter. Um, body wash or soap. I didn't know people even still used bar soap. So I'm going to say body wash. Lush or other bath company. I am dying to try something from Lush because all of their stuff looks really really cool but I don't I don't really do a whole lot of online shopping and unfortunately that is the only way that I can get anything from Lush because uh, we don't have any stores around here so I'm gonna say other bath company even though I really 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 want to try some Lush alrighty next section is fashion jeans or sweatpants I can be caught in both but I'm gonna say jeans on this one, long sleeve or short sleeve? Totally short sleeve. I am so hot natured. I sweat all the time. I know, TMI guys, but yeah, I'm, I'm really, really hot natured. So I have to, even like in the winter, I'm wearing a short sleeve shirt. I got some issues over here with, with, with my undergarments. Okay. Uh, dresses or skirts? I'm going to say skirts because I don't, I think I own like maybe three dresses and I don't ever wear them. I have one that like I can wear casually and that's it. Two that I can wear casually. Well, one is a house dress. I only wear it at home because it's way too big, but it's really, really comfy. Um, so I'm going to say skirts because I have more skirts than dresses. Um, stripes or plaid? Stripes. I really like plaid, but I don't own any. Uh, Flip-flops or sandals? Okay, you guys, you, you're going to have to, you're going to have to take a trip with me for this one because, um, you might not even be able to see them because it's kind of dark over here, but, um, those are all of my flip-flops, and I'm, well, that's the wall, but those are all of my flip-flops and the ones that I have on my feet. Oh, no! The ones that I have on my feet as well. Um, my battery is dying. It was fully charged when I sat down and now it is already dying. I don't know how that happens. Anyway, let's try to power through this video so that we don't have to plug in the camera. Um, scarves or hats? Hats, studs or dangly earrings? Um, hello. Necklaces or bracelets? Again, hello. Uh, heels or flats? Flats because I just can't wear heels anymore. I feel like that, sh that question should have been heels or wedges. In which case I would have said wedges. Um, cowboy boots or riding boots? Riding boots are more comfortable and that's what I have, but cowboy boots are so much cooler. Jacket or hoodie? I'm usually caught in a hoodie. Uh, Forever 21 or Charlotte Russe? Honestly, you guys, I'm 35 years old. I don't go into either store anymore. That's not true. I go into Forever 21, but I don't think I've ever bought anything except camisoles. So I'm going to say Charlotte Russe because I've bought things from there more often than um, Forever 21 but I haven't done it in like five years. Um, Abercrombie or Hollister? Honestly, I've never set foot in either one of those stores. Sex Fifth Avenue or Nordstrom? Neither. I'm, I'm bargain over here, guys. I don't, I don't do high end. Um, <laughs> okay, now we're going to go with hair, curly or straight? Curly, I've been trying to embrace my natural curls because my hair is just out of control right now and frizzy and dry and all kinds of crazy stuff that it shouldn't be at the same time, but it is, so curly. Uh, bun or a ponytail? I do not wear my hair up very often. Um, I like wearing my hair up, but I have a bald spot right at the back of my hairline right now. Um, it's growing back in, and I don't know what caused it to fall out, but um, yeah, I typically don't wear my hair up now, unless I'm at home in which case it's just up on top of my head in some sort of way. It's not a bun, it's not a ponytail, it's just up there. Um, bobby pins or butterfly clips? I love butterfly clips, but I'm 35 and I probably shouldn't. Um, hairspray or gel? Gel, long or short? I have always had long hair, 
but I am really, really wanting to cut it short, like, like right about there, like, yeah. How many times can I say like, 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 like? I want to cut it a little bit short, but I've always had long hair. Um, light or dark? I'm gonna say dark because light hair just doesn't look good on me, but I really do not like my natural hair color, which is like a really, really dark, almost black, um, dark brown. But like the purple, I guess, could still, still be considered dark. I don't know what a red would be considered. Maybe dark. I don't know. So I'm going to say dark. Um, side sweat bangs or full bangs. I would love to have full bangs, but I have a cowlick over here, so I can't pull them off anymore. I have side sweat bangs now, but they have grown out to about here, and they are driving me up the wall. So I'd really rather not have any bangs. Um, up or down. I think we already covered that didn't we with the bun or ponytail typically my hair is down these are the random questions rain or shine I can't pick I like both I love being out in the sun I love having the windows open during the day and letting the natural sunlight come in and not having any like actual lights on um, but the rain is so calming and like that is the best sleeping weather right like best nap time weather best go to sleep at night kind of weather. Oh, it's so great. I love it. And going outside after it's rained and that fresh smell of like everything has been renewed. Oh, it's so good. Uh, summer or winter? Again, I can't choose. We don't really have seasons here though. <laughs> so um, yeah, summer or winter, I can't pick. Like I said, I like being outside, excuse me, in the sunshine, but I also kind of like when it gets a little bit cold. Um, and I love being in um, like Tennessee in the mountains in the winter time. Oh, it's so pretty. Uh, fall or spring, again, I can't really pick. I love when you go outside in the fall and like that first whiff of fall that you get, oh, it like, it rejuvenates me and I don't know why, but it makes me feel so good and I love it. It's the same way with springtime, that first whiff of springtime air that you get just rejuvenates your, your whole body and your soul, and I love it, so I can't pick. Um, chocolate or vanilla? Chocolate, I have a gnat flying around my face right now. Um, chocolate or vanilla? Totally chocolate, all the way. Um, East Coast or West Coast? Neither. Gulf Coast. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't know the difference between the East Coast and the West Coast. I probably should, uh, but I don't know the difference between it. So I am going to say Gulf Coast, you guys, because that is where I'm from. That is where my heart is. That is where my home is. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. It was kind of fun to do this. Um, I don't have anybody to tag <laughs> because the person that I would have tagged to do this tagged me. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Feel free to tag somebody yourself. If you are watching this video, consider yourself tagged. There we go. That's how we're going to do that. I have also devised my own version of this, uh, this or that tag. It is the this or that tag mom edition. Be looking for that video soon. I thought, you know, this isn't really centered. Well, not centered, but this isn't really targeted at my lifestyle and age range group. So I thought it would be fun to do one that's a mom edition and I couldn't find one anywhere else on YouTube. So I thought I would make my own. So like I said, be looking for that soon. You guys, if you have not already and you would like to hit that subscribe button down below, hit the bell next to it. That's going to give you notifications on when I post new videos. Also, if you are not following me on Instagram, you should do that as well. But Lexi Beauty 82 the same way that it is spelled here. You guys, I hope you had fun watching this video. I had fun filming it. I will see you guys later.